Hey guys, what's good? Rising Phoenix One, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're at. Hey, this video is presented by the EA Creator Network and a really big shout out to the EA Community Manager, Nick, because he's the guy who gets us these cards so we can show them to you. Okay, so we've got a lineup made up of the two current supplemental promos, Expressionists, and NBA Brothers. So we've got it as Expressionist and Bros. We have our GM from the Expressionist promo, Chris Bosch. We have our new GM that dropped today from the NBA Brothers promo, Seth Curry, with a plus six outside shooting boost to position. Chris Bosch has a high flyer boost to position. That is the biggest boost category we currently have. And then our other two players from Expressionist at point guard, we got Kyle Lowry. He has a position plus four court general boost. And then Dwight Howard, who has a position inside scoring boost. And then our other starter from the NBA brothers, Thanasis Antetokounmpo. Now, I've heard it pronounced before, Thanasis. However, I have a longtime very good friend whose first name is Thanasis, and that's the way he pronounces it, and his family is Greek too. So we're going with Thanasis, all right? All right, let's take a look at the stats, and in order to do this, we're gonna have to go to the MOTD. So the way the NBA Brothers promo works, we've seen it before, um, you spend cash to get points, you spend coins to get points, and then you can also sell for points John Berry, Brent Berry, Costas Antetokounmpo, and then you cannot sell for points Thanasis, and he has a plus four rebounding boost to position. And then we get to this kind of amazing Seth Curry card, and again, blue now means plus six to position. Will we see plus six blue boost down the road to team? I think so, but I think it's gonna be a while, right? Okay, so let's take a look at this Seth Curry card and his athleticism stats for 105 look pretty good, not great. Uh, quickness though and tip in both look very good. The rebounding's just fine for a shooting guard, especially a six foot two inch shooting guard. Inside offensive game looks really good, especially that 103 layup. And his perimeter shooting is obscene. 97 midi, 107, three, 95 contested, 99 touch, 101 off dribble. If we add the boost he's giving to himself, he's a 103 midi, a 113 three-pointer, a 101 contested, and a 105 touch. That is ridiculous. Then we get to 98 on-ball defense, which is very high for an on-ball defense. 96 hands on perimeter and 93 drawing offensive foul are the other pretty good looking defensive stats. He has very good playmaking stats, looking like a point guard with those playmaking stats. And he's got some pretty high box out. And that's about it for the Seth Curry card. About it, right? About it. With his boost, he has a 113 three-point shot. Yikes, yikes. All right, and the other card in our lineup is Thanasis Santetokounmpo, and here we go. His rebounding, if you look at his primary rebounding, it's a 96, you add in his own boost, he's got a 100. Primary rebounding at small forward. 98 and 99 offensive and defensive, 97 and 92 box out, I like that. Um, yeah, this card is going to be able to get rebounds at the small forward position. He has some pretty good but scattered looking athleticism stats. That 104 strength is over the top. 
upper right hand corner. His inside offensive game looks pretty good. Just below that, his perimeter shooting game, 93 midi, 89 three, 89 contested, 94 touch, just fine for a small forward. This is a pretty good looking card. 98 again on ball defense, 98 block, 97 hands on perimeter, 93 interception, great rebounding, great defense, decent inside and outside scoring. This is a very good looking small forward, if you ask me. And if you're watching this video, you kinda did ask me, so I'm gonna tell you what I think, right? Okay, it's time to jump promos to the Expressionists. And our starting point guard today is Kyle Lowry. He's giving himself a plus four court general boost. That is a plus 40 boost to position. His speed at 103 is terrific. Agility, dribble speed, dribbling looks good. The rest of the athleticism stats are just kind of so-so. Inside offensive game looks very good, especially that 102 layup, 96 scoring with contact. 75 dunk is painfully low, but we don't have to worry about that too much. And then his perimeter game, 100 midi, 96-3, 98 contested, 97 touch. This card is going to be able to shoot. 92 on ball defense for a 103, not bad. 94 steal, very good. 97 interception, very good. 102 drawing offensive foul is terrific. And then look at his playmaking stats. 105 passing, 102 vision, 98 triple threat, 97 foul mistakes. Those are really good looking stats. So not my prototypical point guard for this game at six foot tall, but I think this card is going to be able to play. Our other 103, Dwight Howard, he has a plus four boost to inside scoring. So his inside scoring stats, we'll forget about the free throw, we don't care about that, but his inside scoring stats with his own boost are going to be dunk 106, layup 106, inside the paint 104, scoring with contact 105, yikes. His athleticism stats look largely very good. His 101 vertical is, in my opinion, again, a very important stat, and that's gonna go with a pair of 99s for rebounding, coupled with a 101 and 99 for his box outs. He should be able to get boards. In terms of his perimeter game, you know, I mean, 88 midi is fine, but I'm not gonna be taking perimeter shots with our center. His on-ball defense at 99 is crazy high. 98 block, very high. 97 steal is really high for a center. 97 interception, 102 drawing offensive foul. He has great defensive stats, great inside scoring stats, really good rebounding. And then his offensive post game is all triple digits. Wow, wow. We're really getting some good builds. Um, we got good builds for a long time. We had a little dip in that, but we are right back to really, really good builds on these cards. And then that takes us to Chris Bosch. And if you saw the live stream yesterday, the chat wanted this card to start. We started this card and he did very well in the arena. The athleticism stats aren't that special except for that 103 strength and 101 tip in. Vertical is low at 88. Rebounding is low at 96 and 95. 92 and 98 box out though. That doesn't trouble me at all. My experience with this card is he gets boards. He just gets boards. Upper right hand corner, inside offensive game looks really good. His perimeter shooting, looks very good he's got a 98 3 and a 104 touch and he can bury the rock from the perimeter there's no doubt about it and that's my experience with this card 97 on ball defense is very good 101 hands on perimeter 98 drawing offensive foul 
Those are some good defensive stats. And then, you know, he has scattered offensive and defensive post stats. Some of them are very high and some of them aren't. I mean, his 79 black is kind of disappointing. So overall, I think this card is going to surprise a lot of people. Very Moses Malone-like, right? Very Moses Malone. I did not expect Moses to play the way he did when I got him and have been pleasantly surprised ever since. And I think this Chris Bosch card might be very similar to that Moses Malone card. All right, so back to our lineups here. Again, our starting five, expressionist Kyle Lowry, NBA Brothers Seth, not Steph, Seth Curry, NBA Brothers Thanasis, not Giannis Antetokounmpo, Chris Bosch from the Expressionist promo and Dwight Howard from that same promo as well. So let's jump into Showdown. We're gonna play our first of the day. We're just gonna play one today. We'll see how this lineup, which again is just a mix of the two current supplemental promos can do in regular gameplay. All right, let's do it. Ah, jeez. You know what? Let's play this multi-year and beat it. I've already pulled four multi-years, forfeited against them, didn't want to play them. Dwight Howard gets the tip. Curry, ooh, wow, first shot. All right, first shot with Curry. Let's go, Kyle Lowry. Yeah, he can shoot. Yeah, he can shoot. Give him a boost. All right, come on, little defense on this 110 Jason Kidd. Let's go. I think it's actually a 109 base card. Nice tip. Nice. Let's go to the corner with Seth. He's going to bury this. You bet. 123. 123. Three-point shot. All right. Let's go. Stay on him, Lowry. So far, Lowry staying in front of Kid. No steals yet, but oh, that's a block. That's a block by Antetokounmpo. Wing, nothing but net for Seth Curry. Yikes, yikes. I think this card's gonna be able to play. So far, oh, get that alley-oop out of my house. Get it out of my house. All right, nine to zip. Let's go. We're gonna go with Thanasis Antetokounmpo from the corner. Little shot bubble, nothing but net. There you go, buddy. All right, 12 to zip. Let's keep it up. Let's beat this multi-year, right? Let's beat it. Really good job, Lowry, just kind of neutralizing this Jason kid. Oh, shoot. Oh, he misses it. Harold misses the dunk. Good for you, good for you. Let's go, Seth Curry, deep from the wing. Nothing but net again. 15 to zip. Wow, let's go. Let's go. So 109 versus the 109. Get back on him there, Kyle. Uh oh. All right. He's got him. He's got him. He's got him. Oh, shoot. All right. DeMar DeRozan breaks the shutout. Kyle Lowry. Boom, boom, let's go. 38 seconds left. Lowry harassing Jason Kidd before he brings it back over. Ah, I thought he had it. Get it, there we go, there we go. Let's try a crazy shot with Curry. Oh, oh no, oh no, this is a cheat code card right here especially with that plus six outside shooting boost. Tough time trying to get steals. Oh, nice interception by Lowry. Go to Curry again from the corner. Boom, boom, boom. Just keep him out there. Keep him out there, Kyle. Good on-ball defense. Man, he totally, totally neutralized um, Jason Kidd. Only got one steal but he totally neutralized him, 24 to two. I have very high hopes about the outcome of this one. These guys played great. Oh, this is an easy W over a good multi-year lineup. All right, let's talk about the 103s first. Lowry 
really good on ball defense, got a steal, got an interception, and buried his shots. Thanasis onto Takumpo. I mean, he was there. I don't recall if he got boards or not, but I think he got a tip that turned into a turnover and he buried his shot from the corner. Then Dwight Howard, I'm not sure what he did. I wasn't paying attention. I was so mesmerized by Curry. Um, but yeah, he was there inside playing defense. And then Chris Bosch, oh my gosh, we forgot to shoot with Chris Bosch. Anyway, I'm telling you, Chris Bosch can bury the rock from the perimeter. I can't believe we totally left out one of the two Grand Masters. But anyway, he's a good card. If you want to see him play an arena, just go scroll through the live stream from yesterday, get to the gameplay, and you will see him do pretty well in the arena. And then we get to this new 105 right here, boosted to a 109 Seth Curry. And oh my gosh, his shooting is phenomenal. He missed the first shot straight out of the gate. Not unusual with a brand new card, but after that, he was phenomenal. So there's a couple good grandmasters in the current supplemental promos. And there's also some very good 103s, Lowry, Antetokounmpo, and Dwight Howard. So good luck guys with these promos. Good luck with the main promo, Mint Condition. And with that, it's over, it's done. We're out of here, there's no more. And remember, peace out.